There we go, recording again. Hello, welcome back to the Alexandrian Codex. I am Alex. This is still E U4, if I can scroll out to it, Eve. There we go, E U4. We are playing as Switzerland, going for the Switzer Lake achievement. The Switzer Lake achievement requires that playing as Switzerland, you occupy or you own 99 provinces or cities here, and you have less than one total ports. So no ports, no problems. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> what I need to do is select a rival. Austria is a tempting prospect, but we couldn't beat them in any war. Um, we border Bavaria. They are our same culture group. That would be really helpful. Brandenburg, same culture group. We don't border them. They're far away. Also, they're getting kind of scary. Genoa, we border them, so we could beat them in a war. Very easily, but they're not the same culture group. And Bavaria's army is also much smaller than ours, so we might eclipse them and never have to fight them, and that would just give us more power projection, so... That'd be cool, too. So I think we go with Bavaria. We've been their rival before. We probably will be again. Improve relations with Austria. How likely is that? Not likely. Get access to the sea? Uh -uh. No. Prove legitimacy. That, however, I am into doing. Wow, 100 to gain 10 legitimacy. Yeah, that seems about right. Let's start us down the path of increased legitimacy. No, no, neither of those. Outrage countries. Let's nip any coalition in the... Bud here. Keep y'all drilling down there. Verden, Verden, you of course may have military access. So we have a decently sized Switzerland. That excommunication is just a reminder that I cannot wait until. Oh, well. Oh. That's the start of a coalition. We can have two more alliances, if I can find them. So, Thuringia would ally us. Do I really want to ally them? I don't really care, but... If it scares people out of attacking us to see that we have more allies, then I'd like to do it. Catherine is a decently good heir? Oh no, wife, consort. I'm like, weird that we'd get Catherine, but okay. Alright, let's try to connive our way into another alliance. Cleves is the next closest. Have we improved relations with you? Yeah, I'm excommunicated, but, you know, let's be friends anyway. Army is growable. So, no royal marriage with me because I am excommunicated trash. Yeah, yeah, yeah. okay, fine, fair enough. You outreach countries, it's fine. The Pope is allied with France, otherwise they would make an excellent next target. I always enjoy games where we get to drive the Pope out of Europe, but this does not seem to be one of them. How close are we? It is now 1500. 74% reform desire. Close but not close enough. I cannot wait until we become Protestant. Because Protestant's just better, mechanically, than being Catholic in many regards, and more than that, it allows us to avoid the annoying, annoying habit of the AI to just perpetually excommunicate you over and over and over and over and over. Do I do this? I, I guess we forward into here on the off chance that I become Papal Controller. If I become Papal Controller, then, uh, all is forgiven. I can whiff my own excommunication. What was I gonna do? Oh, I was going to go into here. I can't. You don't have good enough influence. Let's recruit a general the old school way. He's terrible. <laughs> but it lets us drill, and that is what is important here. France is feeling fine about us. We must force them to pay. Who would get mad? The burgers. 
Um, or the clergy... Do I really care? I don't. I do not care here. Yeah, you can have that. Ah, uh, well, okay. Development... Uh, wh whatever. I can make this a state. I have no desire to. I can make... Yeah. This eventually a state. Again, I have no desire to. Well, bien mon. The, the reason I'm against it is that it's the wrong religion. Sorry, religion? I meant culture. Not religion at all. Because we are very German. And pretty happy with staying very German. Ah, I can remove this focus. Maybe I should have reassigned it to military, but eh. Go have eat. We can make states that I don't want to make. Improve relations with folks is going fine. There we go. France is out of here, so we can just focus on fighting the inevitable coalition from forming. I Let's take a look at the coalition map mode. See how this is going. Yeah, alright. It's all pretty much centralized in here. It makes sense. I've been expanding a lot in here. We could potentially go to war with Genoa. No, they're allied with Austria. Never mind. We could go to war with Milan. Allied with Brunswick and... That's not Milan. <laughs> that's, that's Venice. We could go to war with Venice. Brunswick I'm not afraid of. Portugal I'm not afraid of. Venice I'm not afraid of either. So yeah, strong potential target. You are not about to join this coalition. Cool people are leaving the coalition. Uh, but we just lost their statesmen so a bunch of people might be about to join. Give me that. Give me... Ah, new statesman. Never mind. Very nice. It's gonna take a hot minute, a long while, for the... for colonialism to get to us. Oh, this isn't that far away. It could have been out in uh, Lisboa. Could have been in London, so this isn't too terrible, but... It's gonna take a minute. Um... I guess we just develop stuff. I could buy these ahead of time. I don't want to. Well, this is only going to get more expensive every year. Hmm. Nah, nah, let's just develop some stuff with it. Let's do that. <clears throat> buy down to 500. Yeah, that's close enough. About the military coalition. Good, more more people should leave the coalition. Why were we ever in this silly coalition in the first place? Who knows? Not like I'm a rampaging war machine or anything like that. You can have Wallace. <clears throat> this way of states, yeah, but they'll deal with it. Um, I can buy this tech? No, but I can invest in this. But I have this mission I'd rather do. Rival of our rival, not gonna happen. Uh, well, Lorraine. Close, aren't we? We're allied. Well, we were allied. We're No, we are allied. Man, we're allied in our relations to that bad. Yeah, let's do this to try to get a little bit of diplo power. Not gonna be great, but every little bit helps. Spend this on, oh, probably manufactories, right? Yeah, yeah, definitely manufactories. Wittenberg, get me some of that rain, I guess. Okay, that's not that valuable. Good, Bavaria's left the military coalition. Uh, my throne has been claimed by France. Hmm. A secession war between France and Bavaria when I die. Okay, Carl. My dude. All you have to do is reproduce. <laughs> you just need an heir, Carl. No big deal. I can have one more alliance and royal marriage, but I... Well, Ferrara, I could ally. You are a duchy... Yeah, we're doing that. 
I need literally any ally I can get, and more important than that, I need an air, which I just got. Which now it's a material, but whatever. An air means I can't be inherited. Inherited. It. Yeah, Ravensburg has left the coalition. Good, good, good. Everybody else leave the coalition so I can go about conquering again. He's not fantastic. 335 is not amazing, but it's good enough. If it's a 333 or better, I'm probably not going to tank our prestige by trying to get rid of him. Uh, never mind. There goes our prestige anyway. The end of the year, we can get these. Do I want to focus on military? I don't think that I do. Kind of do, but not that important. Oh, wow, our relationship really is terrible with you, huh? It's excommunicated what's doing it, yeah. I could have nipped this in the bud, and really I could do it now. If... No, um, actually, the, uh, restraint of appeals doesn't make it so you're not excommunicatable, it just guarantees, more or less, that you'll be excommunicated. So never mind, I'm like, oh, I could have done the smart thing. No, smart thing is still dumb. That's great. Next 13 years, get some sweet bonuses, get some okay bonuses, pretty good. This is going to take a little while, so maybe I should switch over to focusing this in 26? Wow, that's... Maybe I should have switched over to focusing it in 1500. Oh well, too late now. Alright, point 0.9. So point 0.9 at 90, so when 100... This needs to be 0.5 or more for me to build it. Or 0.48 or more. So no, 0 0.9, 0 0.8. 0.9s, 0.8s, 0.7? Yeah, 0.7 would be worth more. No, 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 no. No. 0.09s and 0.08s are better ducat to profit ratio than Heidelberg. But after that, then Heidelberg then the 07s, then Wittenberg, then the 06s, yeah, 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 et cetera, et cetera. But I'm not going to build our first manufactory for a while, considering that. Uh, who dis? Who dis? Montferrat? What if you Montferrat did it? Wait, what? Oh, because I'm standing there, yeah. Oh, okay. Okay, fair enough. Real. <laughs> hmm, hmm, hmm. Yeah, our, our next idea group should definitely be influence ideas so that I can get fake propaganda and make conquering HRE territories just a little bit easier. Doesn't need to be easy, it just needs to be actionable. <laughs> <laughs> right now I'm sitting at, like, negative 100 is a default with a lot of these people, and that's not gonna make conquering anything easy. It does mean that we can move into- wow, you're allied with Poland and Austria. Presumably because you have this? Yeah. So they think you're a good ally there. Venice? I really do think Venice is our way forward here. I'm gonna build a spy network, generate a claim on Milan. I don't think I'm going to go for it immediately, but I want a way forward. If that's our only way forward, well then I want it to be that. So Savoyan is causing problems, France gives us money. Hey France, thank you, did not need to do that, but I appreciate it. 0 0.08 or 0 0.09, let's build that. Why did you give me money? Holy shit, you have a 5.56. Five, Dang, yo. Pretty good. Uh, none of these matter. Cavalry to infantry ratio. I'll buy that, but I do not intend to buy any cavalry anytime soon. There seems to be some bullshit brewing up here. What is happening here? You're allied with Poland. Huh. Yeah. After all these easy, easy countries are gone, we're gonna have some hard choices to make about routes of expansion. 
Now, we can't unify the Holy Roman Empire because we need to stay as Switzerland, <laughs> I believe. Uh, Poland wants military access. You got it, buddy. Lithuania military access. You can get it too. Sure. Knock yourself right out. Austria has a really strong position in this game. I'm cutting them in two, but they have a pretty good position down here in Croatia. They have this personal union with Hungary, which is being integrated as we speak. So they're going to be quite formidable. They're all, uh, rivaled with France, which is nice, but France hasn't really done anything in terms of growing in a while. We can't rest on our allies' laurels to carry us through this. Not that I'd like to, anyway. 0 0.05, 0 0.08, let's do that. Fabricate on Milan. Now, I can get claims on our claims, so I'm gonna keep going get a claim on Brescia as well, and these are really the only two things that I want from them. Because Verona's a port, and we can't take ports. We cannot get up to any port business at all. Well, we can, we just have to give it away, and at that point, why take it in the first place, eh? Benevolent, nice, we have no subjects. I don't believe we're going to get any subjects anytime soon. Pomerania's prestige is abysmal. Yo, you want no lie? What happens when you die? Your 46-year-old... Some rando takes over. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is worth the risk. Do I take over? Okay, house from Valois takes over. Wah. Can I... Switch this over to giving me prestige? No, but I can get inflation reduction. Let's do that. Well, thanks for following, Pedro Feliciano. Dream Labs is being slow, but Mubak caught it. <laughs> Watch me say Stream Labs is being slow, and here in about 30 seconds it'll pop up. What it normally does. Um. Pondata, Lance Gretchen, yeah. Haha, <laughs> there it is. Yeah, that wasn't quite 30 seconds, but it's about there. Uh, I kind of prefer balance with an offensive edge. I I know, typically, it's a, a popular strategy to focus on offense and always be the one initiating battles. Oh, right, we can't fabricate on this because it's an Age of Discovery now, and I don't have the thing that lets us... What? Yes, I do. Wait, am I crazy? Claims on our claims. Claims on our claims. No, I don't have this. Uh, am I close to getting that? No, nowhere near that. Yep, yep, okay, that was a waste of time. You and you get access... People states fighting people, huh? For you in that war? No. I started a war with them. You sure as fuck would get in on it, though. So, Milan, hey, um... They're in trade league with... Portugal wouldn't join. The Knights Gallery, Mecklenburg, Memmingen would join. I can pull in Lorraine and Thuringia. How fine and good, but how big... ...is your army? Venice? Smaller than mine. You have artillery, though. Hmm. I'll have this claim for a while, right? There's no impending necessity to go to war. I'd rather let our ex aggressive expansion die down and chill out for a little bit. Nassau. Can we even get to 100 relations? No, we certainly can't. Maybe if I allied them and married them, I could, but... Not worth the Diplo, diplo rep, particularly because I'm already drowning in too many relations. Oh, great. Okay, yep. He just has an air now. Waste of time. Mm, now you're at war with Milan, so this is actually more interesting. Because, yeah, you're just attacking Milan and Ferrara, but it means that you're slightly more occupied than you were before. Let's stand here to let us recover and not eat 
that I can beat you on your own. I can probably beat your allies on my own. I'm gonna call in Wayne and Thuringia. Why won't you come in? How to do toward enemies? There. Family ties. Yeah. Yeah. Let's do this. Now, you know, a few people have gotten dragged in. This is probably the most interesting I'd love to make you a vassal. It's not gonna happen. I just love to make it happen. But you don't you don't need to focus on me. Go do other useful stuff. Please. If you two can Who did I call in? I called in Thrangia. Whose army is running up there, and you. So you two go do some bullshit. We'll see this down as quickly as possible. It's making me consider the fact that I don't have any artillery, and really it is the time for artillery. So let's try to buy one, run it in there. That may not go well at all. In fact, we don't need to do that. Let's be smart about this. That'll pull on its own, but it, it is about time to get some artillery going. Mm, are you guys doing anything smart with your armies? No, just attach on mine. Then... Take the Borgo, then we'll smash their army a few times and peace out pretty quickly. More quickly would be better, I suppose. Consort Regency. Wah. Ooh, she's a scholar, though. Well, okay. Could be worse. Could be much worse. Scholar makes tech easier to purchase, seeing as we don't have the colonialism institution be nice to get this. Uh, wow, clergy have a lot of influence in my country, don't you? What's up with this? Uh, ties defended. Yeah, okay. Uh, give me admin support. Now you'll be loyal. Um, give me... Grant you monopoly charters. Give me diplo support. Oh, diets. Give me that support. I don't think any of these are applicable, but it's just always nice to do. We're no longer excommunicated. That won't last long at all, seeing as Pope is still the Pope, and nobody else controls it. The uh, papacy, I mean. No one influences the Pope or pulls the strings, so I think it is us who will be getting excommunicated soon. Unfortunately. There we go. There's Morgul uh, let's go fuck up these secondary countries in the war. Great, 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 great. Who else? You, 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 and you. Um, you're retreating here. Where are you retreating to? If you're going in that direction. You're probably going up here. Let's stock this army and see if I can't wipe it. Or at least we'll whoop. find their friends. Uh, there, we'll catch this here. I would be delighted to get another marriage with you. Let's head on down here to free this up. I should be able to handle that on my own, though, if my ally decides to stick with me. Nope, alright, fair enough. Fair enough, jerk. Uh, can I switch over to something better? Not really, no. Fair enough. Let's get this party started. I'm defending... Oh, right, Milan isn't mountainous. It really should be, though. Stack wipe, there we go. I know stack wipe, there it is. <laughs> well, is this going fair enough? I know the war isn't going super well up here for our allies, but well, for me right now, it's going fine, and that's, <laughs> that's what matters the most. Can I jump over here? No. And down here, occupy that. Occupy that. We'll join back up. Go free up. Raubunden. If I'm pronouncing that correctly, which in all likelihood I'm not at all. 
Alright, fine. We'll swing up by Ravensburg and knock out these guys instead. Well, I'm doing it. You're probably reinforcing that, which isn't great, but I can take it despite these minus two and that minus one. And Oh, it's not pretty, but I think we'll pull it off. We did it. <laughs> it's fine. We'll pull it off. No. No, Alex. You won't. Um, corruption. Professionalism I want and sort of need. Not really need, just sort of need. Go up there, let our army recover for a short while. We can take Milan. No, we can't. Really? That's a coalition I'm not too afraid of. That's a coalition I'm starting to be afraid of. So let's keep these diplomats doing what they do, fixing up our relations with outraged countries. Uh, it's not going to make a immediate substantial difference, but it should make an eventual substantial difference. So this should be falling soon, so that means we can potentially peace out Brunswick. Be nice. Oh my god. The corruption, though. How about... Stop. There we go. You're fully occupied. I don't really care if you stay allied with Venice. I more care about your money. I could make you a vassal, but as I mentioned, we're over the limit. No, not by much. Anymore. Let's do that. Brunswick wants military access. You got it, man. Royal Mary Thuringia. We're in war together. Might as well. Ooh, anybody else want out of here? No, not really. This is in the mountains, right? Right. I would be defending in the mountains, right. I would have an advantage if I attacked here, yes. Should I do it before they get too many more troops there? I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> uh, ooh, definitely don't go for that. That is way ahead of time. Can I keep storing this up? Yeah, but not really. Let's develop something with all of that admin. Let's get it down to... I don't know, 600? Yeah, and buy that down, get these both down to like 600s. Yeah, that's good enough for now. It's Rekt, son? It's R-E-K-T? Riggity, riggity Rekt? I can go here. It would be in the mountains that I'm attacking into, right? Their leaders are demonstrably better than mine. A five shock, that's pretty crazy. And we have a terrible leader, right? One shock. Not great. Not great by any measure. We cannot recruit another guy that way. I might as well do two of these. That gentleman is slightly better, but that would still be a minus two, plus a minus two here, so that's a total of minus four. Even if there is no river crossing on the way there, we would outnumber them two to one, but that's still fairly substantial, so I think we let that go. That's remarkable, really. Um, what are you doing? Lorraine is taking out the rebels there, fair enough. Is this mountainous? No, it isn't. Um, wait until one of you lock in going down there. There you go. I can't attack you in Ravensburg. Of course not. Why, why would anything be easy? Now I can probably peace out and just take Milan. That's still on the table. But I'm a greedy man, and in some way this achievement does reward greediness. So let's continue to be greedy and patient. I can go occupy somebody else. By that I mean Memigan here. I'd like to go this long way around. No, the game really wants me to go this way. Get out of there. I'm attacking you here. Oh, it's farmland, so it's only at a minus two. Now, I say a minus two because they get a plus two here, so that's effectively a minus two. The crossing makes it a minus three, but I think our troops are just better. What a get. Oh, wow, okay. So, total infantry combat ability modifier. We get a plus 10% from this, plus 10% from this, and an additional plus 10% from this. So that's remarkable. Okay, I will be able to stack wipe someone here, potentially. Both of them, there, wonderful. Drop someone off there, let's swing down here and deal with 
this shenanigans. I'm not into that at all. Excuse you. Uh... You clever son of a bitch. Yeah, well, okay, at least it didn't get stack wiped. I should have seen that coming, and in fact, I did see that coming, but I was being greedy. <laughs> so, I will stack wipe you in return. I also want Cremona and Parma. So, although this is an awkward position to be in, it's actually potentially good. Let's have you go here, go occupy these, and see what shenanigans I can get out of this war. Our allies are floundering? No, no, they're doing good work, actually. Um, occupying this, dragging them out of the war, that's gonna be an issue. It's not right now, but it will be. You should be locked in. Oh, well, you're not. Fair, I guess. Split in half, let's just occupy both of these. It won't add to the war score very much. There, you went out of the war. Beautiful. Give me more reparations. Give me money. Break up with Ve Venice? Oh, right. I can't make you do that. Well, fine. Just give me some of this for the prestige. Get out of here. You're attacking Austria. No, you are attacking Genoa. In the Papal Genoese Excommunication War. So. It was the Papal State who sparked off an inevitable war between France and Austria. I'm happy to see France is doing well. I'm hoping that they don't take too many provinces that I want, but if they weaken the Emperor, well, that opens up the floodgates for me becoming Emperor, so I am into it. Let's go into Verona and try to take that in Treviso. Let's just really try to force this war to be over. Right. I could take all this, have a mighty fine coalition. I can take this, have a tiny coalition. Can I force you to release anything? Parma, I can force you to release. I don't have any claims on Parma, so that wouldn't have any consequences for us. Are you not my rival? No, you're not my rival. Uh, give me war reparations. I want more than that, obviously. Uh, what, uh, blah, 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 blah. That's a coalition I'm not afraid of. This is a coalition I am... Still not afraid of, taking both of them would give me a coalition I'm starting to be afraid of. So, one or the other, but not both. Fine. I can drive up the war score by occupying this fort, which is the goal, so I'm doing that. Another good way to do it would be winning battles and removing other people from the war, but we're not doing fine. On everything except manpower, but manpower is kind of overrated. We don't need to be in too many more fights. I think it'll be alright. Actually, split this off. Oh, no, we'd have to take the long way around. Do you have any siege bonuses? You sure don't. So walk out here. Give me someone with, with siege bonuses. Walk you back in there. Cool. Now you walk out of here. Now walk it out. Venice occupied what now? Mines. No, they didn't. No, they didn't. Let's go deal with that. Let's get some manpower. Yeah, this is again reminding me that, oh, it would be a remarkably smart decision if, perhaps, I thought to... Mm, I'm not going to win this, am I? I am, but I don't deserve to. <laughs> It'd be smart of me to invest in cannons, what I'm saying. But now is not that time. Have you run down there? We're very close on this. Yeah, let's recall that. Do I just take those two? Yeah, because then, uh, let me bet. Yeah. Venice doesn't have a core on either of these. If I take this, they won't be able to core it. They're going to have some rebel problems. They're probably going to lose it. In whatever case, I can move in and take it later. I could piece other people out separately, but 
we don't need the money that badly. I'm more interested in expanding than I am in profiting. So let's just take this, get out of this mildly awkward war, and be on my merry way. Uh, or core, mothball these forts, assign this diplomat to outrage countries because there's bound to be a few. And, okay, that's point one. We should build that. Now we can build our first factory because I can afford to and because it would be worth it to. Botnet is no longer a rival. You're no longer a rival. Cool. Drill. Drill. Army is 10 1. Get that up to. So 22 combat with. We are almost at full combat with. So, Venice should be our rival, particularly because I still want things from them. However, our next war should not be against Venice, as that truce is going to take a while, and, as I've mentioned before, it's the wrong culture group. I don't want to have to deal with accepting it. So, let's, uh, 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 wait, I guess? Ship durability. This is useless, this is useless, this is useless, this is very nice, this is magnificent. So, we're spending about 12,000 points on garbage, but it'll get us somewhere nice. But not yet, not today. Yeah, this war is... Dragging on. What? It has joined a military coalition? I don't love that. Of course, they, they have all kinds of reasons to hate me. I'm allied to their rival. I have a core of theirs. Aggressive expansion is off the fucking charts. But that's okay. France is continuing to kick ass over here. It's magnificent. Do I. Ban, 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 ban. What is your unrest? Negative 0.25. Really? War exhaustion and exhaustion or overextension are buying that up quite a bit. I'd like colonialism to be here faster, but it's not that worth it to me. Let's just do this, get more money, and be patient with regards to colonialism. No one else has it, so we're not really losing out on having not having it either. Oh, hey, I got another fort <laughs> in Milan. Do I want the fort? Eh. Not a lot, but I have it. And by God, that must be mean. That must mean that it's worth something. Be mean something. Yep. Must be mean something. Oh, yep. Florence just uh, moved up in here. Well, you're another potential avenue of expansion, aren't you? Yeah, I want that and that, and if I get that, I want that, and if I get that, I want that, and that's all I can get in Italy. And I'm okay with claiming all those Italian provinces because ain't nobody want to be my friend down there anyway. What? Where is this event? Why do? Why does this event not trigger anymore? Uh. Yeah, convert. Would appear. Yeah, I will get a center of reformation. Give me that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, please. Um, start with the easiest ones and work our way up. I can now do all kinds of ideas. Now I want the missionary strength. I did it before, but I certainly do now. Give me that. Manpower needs to recover. Reduce over extension. Let's reduce our extension, that'll get us Diplo reputation, which I need real badly. This is nice. This is better. There we go. And as always, we say fuck the Pope. <laughs> Blue life, true life. Glad to see that France is doing well. Is the Pope doing well? Yeah, well, I have mixed feelings about that. Good because it's bad for our enemies. Bad because it's good for our enemies. 
Military Coalition, Military Coalition, yeah, lots of people are likely to join the Military Coalition now because I've made us even more unlikable by making us heretical foes, but the potential bonuses of becoming Protestant far outweigh the diplomatic consequences. I'm using France as a safety net, which is dangerous. You don't want to have to rely on the AI. Not that it's horrible too, it's just that they're not the most reliable things on the planets. Uh, more loyalty or lose prestige? Who dis? Well, stop. Uh, go here. I'll let morale tick back. I think we're actually too big to be here. No, we're not. Okay. Yeah, we'll let morale tick back just to get that loyalty. The loyalty's not that important. It's more I don't want to lose any more prestige. Who has a bigger army here? Uh, ba, 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 ba. three three. So Rup Rupert, no Charles goes here. Rupert goes here. <laughs> Rupert. No, that's not what that word says, Alex. <laughs> Close, but not quite. Convert more stuff here. Should I wait on this? I should wait on it. Yeah. Uh, should I wait a whole nother year? Yes, I should. And so let's buy up some development now. Again, get this down to 600 is more than enough with me. For me, I should say, not with me. Yeah. Good enough, good enough. Can't buy any more of that? No. Nope. But I can. I can afford to... Well, I can't afford to be doing that, but I should hold off on building anything until I'm done converting these provinces. Because, for example, St. Gallen will not be convertible for another almost three years. Not ideal. As religious unity, crises are... Not great. Milanese separatists. How long do we have? Oh, not all that long. So, cancel drilling, cancel drilling. I could do this. Not going to. I can take any revolt, provided it's not fucking massive. It is fairly massive. Austria has entered into a military coalition against us. That, however, is terrible news. Just fucking terrible news. I really have no one to blame except for myself here. And that's with the... <laughs> oh, bonus Diplo. Oh boy. Ah. <laughs> not, not crazy about this. Yeah, yeah, okay. Alright, fair. Fair. France, Aurora, Lorraine, and Therangia all joined us. Thank God for that. Alright, so, uh... <laughs> um, should I buy this? No. Who Who's plat platinum? So we need Pafaltz to win this, right? Show superiority is the war goal. Why can I not go here? I can. Slow things down. This is not my first coalition war, nor will it be my last, I'm sure. We need to win wars. Carefully, gently, and intentionally. Oh, this is just all completely fucked. Well. Let's go in here, smack this down, hope that that means that I can join up with our good friends here. Walk in. Cool. I'm trying to rescue the Ferrarans. It's uh, only kind of working out, and I'm boxing myself in, which I don't love. I need to get the hell out of here and get into territory near the French. Near the French, though. Oh. 
Well, that was okay. Can I go Cremona, Navarra? No, I can go to Cremona. Hmm. Hmm. How do I get out of here? The French... Are you doing the stupid thing, France? Oh, they may be doing the stupid thing. The stupid thing that I'm referring to is France. Oh, they are. They have exploration ideas. So this is this is something I noticed, and I hope to God that Paradox is patching this. France, in particular, when they start colonizing the New World, send off a percentage percentage of their forces to hold down their colonies. But it's not like 5,000 dudes, 10,000 dudes, 20,000 dudes, something like that. It's most of their army. Like, look, uh, we have 15,000, call that 35, or uh, 15 plus 20, yeah, 35,000, 42,000. Ah, uh, maybe they don't. Maybe they're being good. They have about 50k here. Maybe, maybe they're being good boys. No, 15,000 of their troops are still overseas. Odd damn it. Are you leaving? You're not leaving. Kind of leaving. What if you left, though? Oh my god, I'm so... I don't want to be stuck here, game. Let me out of this hell. <laughs> so, this would give us river crossing. That's no good. I can hang out in Cremona, but I can't hang out in Cremona forever. I cannot save you. I'm sorry. I'm trying, but I cannot save you. Can I retreat? Yeah, yeah, that's perfect. Alright, that worked. Horses, uh, <laughs> they have more than twice our number. Uh, ba, ba, da, ba, 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 ba. This is why you don't do what I did. I'm going to lose this war. Almost assuredly. I can potentially force out individuals, but not easily from where I'm at. Just keep converting shit, my dude. Convert. Get rid of that. Convert. Yeah. Recover abysmal prestige. Oh, I would love to. This is gonna be a step back, but it's not, you know, game ending. Oh yeah, alright, alright. What do you want? So I'd give up a bunch of bullshit in here I'm not crazy about. Don't love that. But let's try let's try something weird here. Um force religion. I can't offer that. That that'd be a pity. Just switch back and forth. Break up with Lorraine look that Lorraine, no problem. Free Savoy? Uh no. Montferrat, I can do. Milan, I can even do. Not good enough. Once more than gold. You require Heidelberg to be part of it. Well, does anybody else have a claim on this? No, I suppose I could give you Heidelberg back. Still not into it, really. <laughs> Once concessions other than gold. I am giving you concessions other than gold. Baden? Oh, okay, that would do it. Hmm. That's not terrible. Not great, but it's not terrible. Do I feel like I can turn this around? I'm not... I'm not that optimistic. I think that I will have to peace out and let them take whatever they want here. So your suggested offers that I free this, this, that. I don't want to do that. See, the reason I'm cool with losing Milan... Montferrat... Uh, oh, well, Milan. Well, let's lose them separately. Is because... This is easy to retake and easy to recore. Also, it's the wrong culture, so I don't care that much. I can return course to... Nope. You want Heidelberg. You demand Heidelberg. So, fine. We shall do that. Breaking up with Lorraine, no problem. Giving you money, I'm not crazy about, but I can do it. Giving you more money. Okay. So. <laughs> I keep I keep clicking onto the wrong thing. Montferrat, 
Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Wittenberg. If I gave up mines and this, and I could keep all my terrible Italian territory, which would be nice not having to retake that, fine, fine. A minor setback, but fine. Well played, AI. For once, well played. And by that I mean that was completely on me. <laughs> and I can blame them if I want, but it's my fault for being like, first I'm gonna go right up to the edge of having a coalition form, then I'm gonna convert to a different religion and make sure that the coalition forms. Stupid. Very stupid. This army can handle rebels. Let's do that, do that. Mothwell these forts? Hell yeah, Mothwell these forts. What do we have going on here? So, Saberyard, Montferrarin, and Milanese Separatists. Let's take things a little easy on myself here. Saberyard, no. Montferrat can't do much about that. Milanese, I can make that a bit easier on myself. Now, Montferrat is probably the first that's gonna fire off, so let's go down here. I was wrong! So, so, uh, witch trials and church power. Yeah, church power is real nice. We need to roll better than that. I still rolled like trash. I have the wrong guy. Could not have trusted the AI to assign the correct general. Oh, well. Conversion successful. Yeah, yeah. Gotta convert a whole bunch of shit. Ferdinand is incredibly unremarkable. Build more favors with you. Frederick is okay, but my prestige is so abysmal that I cannot do anything about that. Who took her out of coup? Really, you have that much influence, do you? Congrats on that. By that I mean... We will deal with this. Um, <laughs> there, dealt with. <laughs> I suppose we should do that. Oh, do I buy back manpower? No, let's just let it slowly, steadily increase on its own. France, why? Wasn't even getting a warning that they wanted to decrease it. Ah, you're allied to my rival in the Papal State and Venice. God damn it, I hate when the AI does this. Can't change that. I can change this. Yeah, remove that. Instead, let's embrace hating Florence. Now we would be friends again. Definitely fix that alliance. Normally, sometimes the game will have a notification like, Hey, your alliance is about to break. Other times, like in this case, it just immediately breaks with no notification. So let's increase trust. We can't call them into any wars, but I have a feeling we won't be having any wars for a short while. That's a minor setback, an annoying setback, mind you, but a minor one, all things considered. We're still doing fairly well. We're bigger than we used to be, at least. Mines and Platinet will not be hard to retake. Remember, we took all that in one war anyway. One or two wars, anyway. I think for the time being, we focus on taking these rich Italian territories. Which will increase our aggressive expansion significantly. But also it'll let us get AE down here instead of up here. Would be nice. Oh, well, I'm saving up for this still. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely. Definitely. This is expensive, fort maintenance, war reparations, army maintenance, yada yada yada. Very expensive. It's fine. It's minorly annoying, but it's fine. St. Gallen, you are mad because you're the wrong religion, I believe. Yeah, stability though. That's a godsend. No, you're mad because of nothing. No reason. You were just converted, that's why.
Yeah, I am the first real Protestant power. I really hope that we are the infection that leads to France becoming Protestant, because that would separate them from their friend the Pope, and would, by proxy, if benefit me. If nothing else, we get church power. And church power is very, very nice for discipline, morale of armies, and manpower recovery speed, I think? Yeah, manpower recovery speed is probably what we'll go for here. Yearly prestige could be nice. Prestige does result in higher morale of armies, so I might go for that. Which spot? Which hunt spiraling out of control? Ooh, is uh, is the base tax worth it? Yes, yes, it's worth it. <laughs> Particularly because this province is the wrong culture. Anyway, and and on top of that, its autonomy is a hundred percent, so it doesn't really do anything for me anyhow. Womp womp. Yep. I I recall that when starting this run, I'm like, so we just need to take things slow and easy. The worst thing you can do is rush this, because that's how you build coalitions, and well, I I did that to myself. Entirely did that to myself. That's one thing I really like about this game. And about many of Paradox's games, is that Regardless of how bad a situation is, for the most part, you can't just blame the game being stupid or bullshit or whatever. It, it typically is on you for misplaying. And that... There are lessons in that, and I appreciate being able to learn while playing a game. So, what do we learn? Oh, we learn that we're going for influence ideas. <laughs> that maybe we should have started instead of quality with influence ideas. But that's all right. We're on the right path now. It's been about three hours. By that I mean it's been another hour. We still have at least two hours left for tonight, but if you were watching on YouTube, as I imagine you probably are, because most of my viewership is on Twitch, and people only watch YouTube to catch up on what they miss out on. But hey, if you are, thanks. Um, you know the deal, I imagine, at this point. I'll see you next time. This is it for today, etc., etc., etc. Thanks for hanging out. Till then, see you, YouTube.